hey, fresh friends, it's Delaney. Hi, I'm so <laughs> Today is first day of the Iraq. It's Friday. I don't even know what time it is. It's 5.27 in the morning, and I'm gonna get my hair and makeup done in a little bit. How are you, Alexis? I mean, I'm fine, but I think this cereal can use a little bit more sugar. Alexis. <laughs> I literally um, did not sleep like at all last night. I was so nervous. My mom went to Macy's at about 12 a.m. last night, so <laughs> I went to bed at like 10. I woke up at midnight, and then I woke up again at 2:50, and then I never fell back asleep. I sleep fine when I provide it. Like, what are you doing? Goodbye, everybody. So I'm done getting my hair and makeup, and I'm with Mama Cathay. I have false eyelashes again. You can see they're really long. Overall, I'm like in love with this look. I think it looks a lot better than the bun wig because. Um, when I would do the bun wig myself, I would look like a potato. Like Bozo. Yeah. Like Bozo the Clown. <laughs> Hi, best friends. It's Anne-Marie, and it's very loud because I'm in the practice room. Hi. Hello. Today is day one of the Eruptus. Everybody. <laughs> I got a spray tan, but I didn't wash it off yet, so. And here are her legs. Oh, versus Caroline's I'm legs. Great. And here are my legs. And my legs. Oh, and Hello. Hello. Goodbye, fresh friends, because I'm going to eat food. And let me figure out how to turn this thing off. I think, I think this is the right button. I hope so, anyway, so, bye. Me, why you gotta be so mean? <laughs> Someday I'll be living a big old city and all you're ever gonna be is me. <laughs> friends it's Delaney um sorry I look like a potato um it's getting really well actually I kind of look like a lima bean but whatever it's 9 25 at night and I thought I would vlog because I wanted to tell you what happened today and not the best result I had to get up at 5 o'clock for my hair and makeup appointment at 5 30 which you saw in the vlog I went down to get my hair and makeup done it went really fast I actually I got there at like 5 35 and it was done by 6 I went back to the room for a little while I chilled um, and then I went down, I got stretched, I got ready, I got my number. Um, I was so pumped and ready to get on the stage. I'm trying to look as confident as I can, even though underneath the smile and the makeup and everything, it's just a nervous wreck. And I start dancing, and I'm dancing really well, and all of a sudden, I feel my crown bobbing up and down and starting to fall off. So my crown is falling off. In my head, I'm just trying to say, like, keep your composure. Um, just pretend like it's not happening, look as confident as you can, keep that smile because as soon as you lose confidence, the judges are going to move on. I felt it like, because like my crown, you know, obviously it's like right here, I felt it move to the side of my head and then at the end of my middle step, it fell off. I just kept dancing and I actually danced really well. Probably one of the better times that I've ever danced. By the end of my dance, my wig was like completely falling backwards, my crown was on the floor and my poof had disintegrated. Basically looked like a lima bean and, or like Mr. Potato Head. So I walked off the stage, I was clearly upset and stressed, and my teachers were trying to calm me down as much as they could. I was like closer to the end of the rotation for hard shoot and like the beginning of soft shoot, so like couldn't have been a worse rotation for me. My teacher had to take my entire wig off and redo it. I was stressing out and freaking out because if you don't know this, I'm, I stress out and freak out about everything. I didn't have time to redo a poof. I didn't have as much height. I actually ended up changing crowns because I feel like that was what the problem was. I did my soft shoot. My teacher said it was gorgeous. I felt like I was so strong and I completely danced the best I could. And I ended up fixing my whole entire wig again in case if I did get a recall, which was doubtful because my hair completely fell apart. Why would the judges pick someone that can't even put themselves together? I didn't recall. It just really sucks because I recalled the past three years all because of my stupid hair and me looking like Mr. Potato Head. I didn't recall. I didn't want to come out here today and just sound all happy because this is a vlog. It's real life. And I didn't want to say, oh, like, I'm happy that I didn't recall because I'm obviously, you know, I'm upset. But I don't want to sound like I'm, like, not taking anything for granted. 
because I had I did have a good time today besides the circumstances and although I was extremely stressed out from my first round I'm very curious to look at my results because I really want to see if the judges totally tanked me for my hair just flopping out but unfortunately not everything goes your way and you just have to push through that being said I'm so excited to do Hornpipe and Real next year. I am selling my dress. If you're interested, please contact me. I feel a little bit better now that I talked to somebody about it. Um, I thought I just, I had to explain myself because I didn't want to leave you hanging or tell you some stupid excuse. This is a real channel, this is real life, and I want to let you guys know what's happening. I'm excited for tomorrow. A lot of people dance, and I'm really hoping for some good results and uh, for all the girls to dance their best. That's all that you could ever hope for, you know? I have to get a little forehand ready. No matter what happens tomorrow, I'm honestly so proud of them. But I'm just gonna enjoy the rest of the weekend with my friends and cheer them on and support them. So don't ever give up on your dreams. And I hope all of you had a good Aractus this year. I'm sorry for the hot mess that I am. Oh, but before I go, I met an amazing best friend today. His name is Ryan. Here's a picture that I took with him. He was so sweet. It honestly lifted up my spirits a lot today. Good night, everybody. I'll see you guys next Wednesday.